Today, we'll be sharing 10 tips for how to make your reborn baby look realistic in a pram or stroller, plus recommend the right type of stroller to purchase if you can't afford a complete travel system. Hi, Dolly friends. This is Kitty. And I'm Tati. And, and welcome, welcome to Little Bottle Nursery. Nursery. Our channel is dedicated to our love of dolls and we feature reborns, realistic dolls plus vintage dolls. So stick around and have some dolly fun. Hi everyone and welcome back to our channel. If you are new to our channel or here for the first time, we want to warmly welcome you and thank you for joining us. Before we get started, make sure to give this video a thumbs up and hit subscribe and ring the bell so you get updates for all our videos. Next, head over to Instagram and give us a follow at Little Wattle Nursery. So, let's get started. We're going to use Matilda May to demonstrate the stroller option and we're going to use Little BJ to demonstrate the bassinet slash pram option. So, tip number one, and this is the most important tip. Make sure you purchase a pram or a stroller that looks realistic for a young baby. Newborns and young babies are rarely seen in strollers. So if you can find a pram or a stroller that has a bassinet or a car seat capsule, it will definitely add to the realism. Also, use a pram or stroller that has a reverse facing option like this one so that your reborn baby can face you. This will also add to the realism. Tip number two, if your budget doesn't stretch far enough to purchase a pram that has a bassinet or even a travel system, try and find a stroller that can recline, that's got a really good recline, because it's going to add to the effect of your reborn baby sleeping. So we're very fortunate with our pram stroller system that it's, it's two in one. So you can see this is reverse facing, which looks more realistic for a young baby. I'm now going to switch it the other way so you can see what it looks like the other way. So this is switched round the other way. So this is front facing. And this is ideal for toddler reborn dolls. But I'm going to switch it back the other way now for the purpose of the exercise. As mentioned previously, if you can purchase a stroller that has a really good recline on it, it's going to look more realistic for a young baby. I'm going to show you how I like to re recline this stroller for Matilda May. So here's the demonstration of a stroller not fully reclined, but it is reclining a fair way back. And as I said, that's going to add to the realism of your young reborn baby in a stroller. Number three, dress your baby in weather appropriate clothing. One way to receive unwanted attention from strangers in public is not dressing your reborn baby appropriately for the weather. If it's cold, put socks on, and mittens and a beanie and in summer keep things light and casual with t-shirts short sleeves and hats now it's winter here in australia so we have matilda may and bj all snuggled up in their winter woolies tip number four to avoid a stranger approaching you about infant safety issues make sure you buckle your baby into their stroller tip number five make sure that your reborn baby is not going to roll around in the stroller so the clips should work reasonably well securing your reborn baby into the stroller but if you find that they're still moving around a little bit you can purchase an insert to put inside the stroller or otherwise, uh, just roll up a couple of blankets. So that's what I've done here. I've placed one behind Matilda May's head and neck to, to provide support there. Moving down, I've rolled a blanket on both sides of her to provide some support so that she doesn't roll sideways. And then again, underneath. With our bassinet to stop BJ from sliding around, we like to use a thin blanket underneath with a sheepskin on top. 
and then we also roll a blanket just to support his head and neck properly. Tip number six, pose your reborn baby appropriately. If they are a closed eye sleeping baby, you can turn their head as if they are sleeping, just like this. So for tip number six on an awake baby, you want to fix the baby's gaze on something, like they're looking out at something. So maybe just slightly turn their head as if their gaze is fixed on something. Tip number seven, add a weather appropriate blanket over the top of your baby. So a nice cosy woolly one for winter or if it's summer, something lovely and cool like this one, like a muslin cloth one. Here's Matilda May demonstrating tip number seven, using a weather appropriate blanket. Tip number eight for more realism, add a pacifier, scratch mittens, a hat, a plushie and clip on toys. So here's Matilda May demonstrating tip number eight. For more realism, I've added a pacifier, a plushie and a clip on toy. And being an awake baby, I have actually fixed her gaze onto that toy to make it look more realistic. Tip number nine is an important one. Just make sure your baby's cloth isn't showing. Just do those final little touches because that will be a dead giveaway if the cloth is showing. And the final tip, tip number 10, pull the hood down to place a shadow over your reborn baby. You can also place a blanket over the pram like they're sleeping or even just pull it halfway up like so. And that still adds to more privacy. We're very lucky that with this stroller that the visor comes down all the way. But I'll just pull it back a little bit. This is probably what most people would be dealing with with a stroller. Just creating that shadow over your uh, baby that's awake. And if you've got any other extra pram accessories like a muff, add that as well because that's going to add to the realism also. Oh, look at Matilda May in the stroller. She looks so real. And she's looking at her little monkey toy. How gorgeous. On a final note, purchasing a second-hand pram or stroller is a great way to save a lot of money. Thrift stores, Facebook marketplace, Gumtree or garage sales are a fantastic way to pick up a bargain. Well, thank you everyone for joining us for the 10 tips on how to make your reborn baby look realistic in a pram or stroller. If you know of any other useful tips, please share them in the comments. Please like, comment and subscribe to see more of our Dolly content. And if we don't see you during the week, we'll see you on Sunday. Bye-bye.